In this video, we'll show you Roundspan's FFT Spectrum Analyzer window. The all important FFT Spectrum Analyzer dominates Span's interface, showing the spectral response curve of the input signal chosen using the group channel selector, with frequency on the X axis and amplitude on Y, and plenty of customization using the controls above the display and in the Spectrum mode editor. The info line at the top of the spectrum shows the frequency, note pitch and amplitude at the current mouse pointer position. We'll look at the spectrum mode editor in the next video, but any presets made with it show up in the mode menu. To get you started, and quite possibly finished, a useful selection of modes comes built in, each one defining the analysis type, FFT block size and vertical and horizontal display ranges amongst other things. Run a signal into the plugin and step through the presets to get a feel for them. The hold button simply freezes the spectrum when activated and releases it when clicked a second time. The menu next to it offers a palette of 16 color options for the spectrum, and the underlay menu lets you show the spectrum of any other channel group behind the main spectrum in a pre-assigned color for simultaneous analysis. The FFT Spectrum Analyzer display is fully zoomable using the horizontal and vertical scroll bars. Drag their edges to zoom, then move them around or use the arrow buttons to navigate in one direction at a time. Dragging the diamond button, bottom right, enables combined horizontal and vertical navigation, and double-clicking a scroll bar or the diamond toggles between its current state and fully zoomed out. Holding the Alt or Option key and dragging within the display draws a box, which is zoomed into when the mouse button is released. Holding Alt or Option and double-clicking zooms all the way back out. Clicking the spectrum resets it, important when using the average analysis type. And right clicking it copies the frequency at that point to your operating system's clipboard for pasting into an EQ plugin. Control or command clicking and holding the mouse button down applies a bandpass filter to the input as clearly visualized in the display. Drag to adjust the frequency of the filter and its peak amplitude and scroll the mouse wheel to narrow and widen its bandwidth. Using this you can solo specific frequencies in the signal in order to isolate problem areas. Download over 30 exclusive plugins. Get hundreds of pro quality samples and power up your production skills with in depth tutorials. We break it down for you step by step, and you'll see exactly how it's done in expert video guides and producer masterclass sessions with pro producers. Get all this and more with Computer Music Magazine every month on iPad and iPhone, PC and Mac, Android, and in print.